morning my loving YouTube family. I hope you guys are having a great morning. Today is Thursday. Let's do what we need to do. Um, you know, a friend of mine once told me it's not about getting up early. It's about having something to do once you get up. So yeah, it's great to get up early, but you feel even more motivation and inspiration sometimes when you already have a plan for your day. So yeah, that's important too, you know, because I know sometimes, unfortunately, we tend to feel, not tend to feel, but can feel like, oh my God, like, why should I even get up early? Or like, when I get up early, then I just feel exhausted and I don't know what to do. So when you have a plan for your day, then it ends up being productive and we end up feeling good. So that's awesome. But I'm doing a video to tell you guys that ah, guys guys wait I don't want to scare you guys nothing crazy like that hold on <sighs> so it's my birthday weekend and I'm too too excited oh my god guys like after ovarian cancer and you know not having this big smile on my face even though I did at times because I was just being positive but Oh my God, I got to celebrate my birthday. And last we heard from the doctors, my blood exams, my cancer blood work was good. My last um, scans were good. Um, I have another scan coming up in two weeks. Um, and, you know, things are good and it's my birthday. Like last time that I celebrated my birthday, guys, we were all sad and we all wanted to cry. It was a different energy. We all knew that I only had one year left to live because that's what I was told at one of the oncology offices here in New York City. Guys, and I'm living past that year. And I'm not putting my guard down. I still drink my celery juice. I still drink my carrot juice. I still have my supplements every day. I still drink plenty of water throughout the day. I still have a sleeping schedule. I'm in bed before 10. Um, guys oh my god oh my god oh my god i'm so happy i get to celebrate like celebrate it not only like with my friends and family but i get to celebrate it with you guys like you guys were with me throughout this whole thing and i i love you guys so much and thank you for celebrating with me thank you for all your messages thank you for supporting me throughout this journey oh my god birthday weekend what oh thank you god you know this is truly, truly amazing. I got to work, I'm parked at work, and I'm having some coffee. I'm gonna do my makeup probably pretty quickly, and the celebration starts tomorrow. Oh my God, yes, 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 yes. Thank you God for my health, and you know, I was able to now spend so many months with my daughters, with my family, with my friends, and you know it makes me feel special because I just feel like oh my god like God has a bigger plan for me he has a purpose for me and he didn't think that you know it was my time to leave that that I had an expiration date at this moment or that my time was up you know God didn't believe that and I didn't believe that and I had faith and everyone who prayed with me had faith um, and I'm so happy to be here now, guys. And anyone that I can share the protocol that I did, I'm happy to share it. And I'm so sorry for some, some of you that are still going through cancer. This thing is crazy and it can happen to anyone. It can happen at any moment. God forbid, um, people get reoccurrences. And I, I hate that. I hate that it could even exist, but you know what I do love, guys? I love that there's something that we can do. I love that there's something that we can do for our health to stay alive and to keep moving forward. And if I can help you with that, I will. So thank you to all of you that have reached out with questions on Instagram. You know, for those of you that don't have my page yet, it's LaRuby Lopez. I appreciate your messages. If I didn't get to someone, I'm sorry, but for those of you that I got to, you know, keep writing because I have more answers and it's going to be okay and you're going to get through it, whether it's you or a family member, 
you know, and I'm so sorry to hear that some of us have that in our family right now. Um, but yeah, please keep staying in contact, whether through YouTube, whether through um, Instagram, whether through my number of you guys like know me personally. But I love you guys very much, personally or not. It's personal. It's personal, personally or not. It's still personal. And, you know, you guys, I love you all in the same capacity. And, oh, my God, guys. Oh, my God. I got to have a birthday where I don't have to think that cancer, <laughs> that cancer is in my life. What? <laughs> Um, oh my god. This is too much. It's, it's a lot. It's a lot. Because it was too much last year. It was too much. And I'm telling you right now. And I've told you individually. I've told friends of mine. I'm like, without you guys. You know, as I was like talking to a few of you yesterday. As we are getting ready for this weekend. I'm like, without you guys. I wouldn't have been able to do it. And I tell you guys now too. My YouTube family. Without you guys, I wouldn't have been able to do it either. Because, yeah, like, I came on here, like, positive and everything. Um, and, like, always, like, sharing my latest research. Oh, I found out this. I found out that. And I'm doing this now. And I'm trying that. But, like, deep down, it was hard. It was hard. And I would break down on my own sometimes in my room by myself. And it was hard and you know sometimes it's hard because I'm like you know when you get those little thoughts of like but what if it comes back or like people have asked me like LaRuby do you think it could ever come back and I'm like you know what I've heard that it comes back sometimes but let's hope it doesn't you know let's stay positive and let's stay in action oh my god guys these are like less tears of like sadness and more tears of joy because um I don't know, like, God has a bigger purpose. God has a bigger plan. Um, and I wanted my health back, and I have my health back. And for that, I'm just, like, so, so incredibly grateful each day. Each day that, you know, I just, like, sometimes we forget, but, like, let's go. Let's wake up and, like, make the most out of each day because we are here. We're alive. And I feel like when you don't have an expiration date... Like, you feel like, sometimes like, oh, I'm just going through today. Oh, eh, it's another day. Or something like that. Or, mm, you know. Oh, yeah, just a Friday night. Or just a Saturday. Oh, yeah, like, just the morning. Just a slow morning. No, it's not just a slow morning. No, it's not just a Friday night. No, it's not just a Saturday night. It's your life. You're alive. And, uh, like, how amazing is that? That we are alive and that we do not have an expiration date hanging over our heads we may have deadlines hanging over our heads like to live in this world and work and survive but that's just like so much smaller than when you could possibly face a cancer diagnosis with an expiration date so i'm telling you guys like i'm so grateful right now i'm so thankful i'm looking forward to my birthday weekend um <laughs> Like, I'm, I just, so many emotions right now. I love you guys very much. I'm going to continue having my coffee, my pink cup. I think I had a dream about it. <laughs> now that I told you guys my pink cup. I love you guys very much. And for anyone, again, that's experiencing cancer or anything like that, please don't lose hope. Please don't lose faith. Please don't lose your essence and like will your your will to fight don't lose it don't lose it because once you lose it then the battle is over and anything i can do any advice i can give i'm here please just reach out please just go through my videos and see what i have spoken about what i have done and um yeah guys i'm gonna have to like wrap up and like start getting ready and, like head into work I love you guys very much. I can't wait to tell you about my birthday weekend. I'm going to tell you guys ah, what I did and how it was. Um, 
and maybe how each day is going like my daily vlogs of before I'm excited for tomorrow and um, have the most beautiful day again I know what it feels like you're gonna be okay trust me you're going to be okay it has to be okay don't look at the cases where the people didn't succeed you know like yeah let's look at all of them okay but focus more on the cases where the people succeeded which is what I did I went to crispycancer.com I went to ludwigjohnson.com and I went to TikTok and I went to different pages as the ones that I mentioned and I told and I and I researched you know holistic healing and I found people and I saw the interviews of the people that were able to heal holistically and that stayed alive and I focused on them and I'm like oh if they survived it, and I would look up ovarian cancer and all types of cancers, I'm like, if they survived it, why can I? I'm like, isn't it possible? Isn't it? Isn't it? You know. And it is possible. And again, we don't know what the future holds, and we have to like continue to be serious with our health and our nutrition and our protocols and our emotional well-being, our physical and everything. Right? But one thing we do know is that it is possible it is possible and it's gonna be okay it is possible to heal and you will heal okay I love you guys very much I'll see you guys very soon have the most beautiful amazing intentional energetic and creative day I love you guys bye and as always, please like, share, and subscribe. It really helps my channel. And thank you so much for supporting my channel. See you guys very soon. Bye. Birthday weekend. Yes.